Psalm number 27 says like this, The Lord is my light and my salvation, whom shall I fear? The Lord is the defense of my life, whom shall I affright? When evil doers came upon me, do devour my flesh, my adversaries and my enemies, they stumbled and fell. Though a host encamp against me, my heart will not fear. Though war arise against me, the in spite of this, I shall be confident. I mean, one thing I have asked from the Lord that I shall seek, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life to behold the beauty of the Lord and to meditate in his temple. For in the days of trouble, he will, I mean, uh, counsel me in the, in the tabernacle, in the secret place of his tent, he will hide me, he will lift me up on a rock. Amen. And, and now my heart will be lifted up above my enemies around me and will offer in his tent sacrifices with shouts of joy. I will sing, yes, I will sing praise to the Lord. Hallelujah. Hear, O Lord, when I cry with my voice and be gracious to me and answer me. When you said, seek my face, my heart said to you, your face, O Lord, I shall seek. Do not hide your face from me. Do not turn your servant away in anger. You have been my help. Do not abandon me, nor forsake me, O God, my salvation. For my father and my mother have forsaken me, but the Lord will take me up. Teach me your way, O Lord, and lead me in a level path because of my force. Do not deliver me, deliver me over to the desire of my adversaries, for false weaknesses have risen against me, and such a breath out violence. I would have despised unless I had believed that I would see the goodness of the Lord. In the land of the living, wait for the Lord. Be strong and let your heart take courage. I mean, yes, wait for the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. So when we read uh, uh, these uh, verses, maybe uh, Psalm number 27. I mean, Psalm number 27 is, uh, I mean, David is revealing uh, his strong confidence in God. Hallelujah. So now, now today we are here in the presence of God to worship the Lord. But before that, let me encourage every one of you this morning that here David is revealing his strong confidence in God. The strong confidence in God. Hallelujah. So remember this morning, the confidence in God will strengthen us to face the darkest situations of our life. Hallelujah. The confidence in God will help every one of us and strengthen every one of us to face the, I mean, I mean the tough situation of our life and the and the and the difficult situation of our life. Hallelujah. In first verse, uh, I mean itself. I mean, I mean, he professes, I mean, uh, his personal faith and the and the relationship with uh, God through the use of the personal pronoun, my name. My, my, my. He's using that word. He's using that pronoun. I mean, to, to, to reveal his relationship and his personal faith and his personal trust in the Lord. Hallelujah. So he says that, I mean, three things are there, you know. He says, God is my light and God is my salvation and God is my defense. Hallelujah. God is my light. God is my salvation and God is my defense. Hallelujah. We believe in, in, in a world that, uh, I mean, we, we understand that the world is, uh, I mean, there are, I mean, uncertainty and there is no safety at all in this world. But do not be worried about anything because, uh, I mean, God is our light. Hallelujah. And he is our salvation and he is our defense. Hallelujah. For, uh, I mean, Proverbs chapter 18 verse 10 says that, I mean, the name of the Lord is a strong tower. The name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous shall run into it and be saved. Hallelujah. So this morning, as we are gathering together in the presence of God, let us trust in the Lord. I mean, we have the safety, we have the protection in the hands of God. Hallelujah. Because, I mean, our God is our light and our God is our salvation. Our God is our defense. Hallelujah. So let us have that I mean, personal relationship and fellowship with God this morning, who is our light and who is our salvation and who is our defense. Hallelujah. 